What is up guys, it is Shot by a Shadow, and today, I bring you some sharpshooter on the map Yemen on Black Ops 2. I start off with the Double Dildo 5-7 Akimbo, even though that's what Double Dildo stands for. And I honestly, I have to say that in the beginning of this game, I honestly go to town. I, you might not even think it's me playing, but of course it is. Uh, I don't really use anybody else's gameplay. I have not yet done that. I might do that when I get bigger, to just feature people that don't have the money to buy a capture card or such like that. Look at this, it's already double points, like 33 seconds in. Like, that is insane. At least that's what it says for me, 33. But yeah, I really do like doing these uh, live uh, sessions on Friday. This, of course, was not a live session because I believe I got it. I was just sort of messing around that this time. Uh, I got it, and I came in second. I was, okay, picture this, nine seconds away from victory. Somebody gets like a double kill and passes me with double points. So the final score I get was 310. They got 320. Like, I hate people that any record or something that is broken by like that little. Like, if you get like, all right, say you were, you get a score like what I got today in my live commentary that I'm not going to even use because it's freaking probably one of the most awful things I've ever seen in my life. It was like 6 and 24. Like, you, de if you're going to beat me by, like, 500, then fine, you deserve it. But if you're going to beat me by 10, then you're just kind of an asshole. So, I'm sorry. But that makes me feel like I'm a horrible person, and I suck. So, yeah, right now I'm going to work with this little S12 here. And if any of you guys know if it's supposed to be actually Spaz12, can you let me know? Because it's kind of curiosity, and I'm figuring it out. So, I do really enjoy doing this. Look at this loop-de-doop technique. Whoop, whoop. Tough. Lightweight, that's what I got from there. Alright, and then I get extreme conditioning, and yeah. So, I want to talk to you guys about other stuff that I do not really know what to talk about. Uh, my Yash video, that is, I don't know, it's just kind of a cool video. I'm not gonna lie, uh, it's Friday, it's Lazy Friday, I just wanna play. Uh, probably gonna get off soon, actually. I was just hitting up some good ass sessions. But, you know, it's, it's good shit. Okay, I'm getting invited because I have Black Ops open. Mother effer. But, like, look at this. Okay, the MP7. I th yeah, that's the MP7. Uh, This is, like, the second to last gun that I actually do well with. All right. They give me, what, double dildos, um, a ballistica, which is actually a really fun gun, uh, a MP7, then? No, S12, then the MP7. They're going to give me the crossbow, which I'm not too bad with. The, like, L86 light machine gun, which I'm horrible with. I cannot, I'm really not good with whatever the hell was on that gun. Um, and I believe the last gun is a war machine. It was, I don't even know. The war machine was like effing Modern Warfare 2. It was insane. Look at that, Commando Pro. You got fucking noob tube guns. Like, really? It's like just, it's Modern Warfare 2 all over again. Black Ops 2 definitely wants to change Modern Warfare 2. Puts the RPD in zombies, puts the Scar H back in, puts the Vector back in, and you're telling me this game is not a like Modern Warfare 2. I actually was playing Modern Warfare 2 a little bit this week, which is really funny because I figured I'd be all over Black Ops 2, but my friend and I decided to start that whole clan thing, which we are going to get rolling soon, hopefully. Recruit some people that want to join. If you want to join a Modern Warfare 2 clan, uh, go to the Yaosh video. And you can uh, see the, what the clan is called and what our names are and who you have to add on PlayStation Network. So yeah, just figured I'd let you know that. Um, in other news, boners. In triple news, I don't know. I had this sore throat all week that I figured I'd tell you guys about since I really don't have anything to talk about considering it's not even Monday and I don't have to do a commentary like this. But, you know. So I've had this sore throat, and uh, apparently it was nothing. It was a common cold throat, and every morning I hawk a loogie and spit it out, and it's like brown, and it's probably one of the most disgusting things ever. But, yeah, pretty bad. I went to the doctor. He said, uh, yeah, it was nothing. And I have to take DayQuil and NyQuil. DayQuil is probably the nastiest shit I've ever had in my entire life. It smells like oranges, but it, like, tastes like death. I'm not even lying to you guys. That's basically what it's like. It's like death in a bottle. Like, NyQuil is so much better. If NyQuil didn't have that 
it, the alcohol or whatever in it that, that makes you, like, sleepy. How do you get a hit marker from a, a noob dude? I'm just wondering. Like, I shot him direct impact with, like, a grenade, practically. Blew up behind him, and he's like, no, I'm good. Look, I tried to pull Modern Warfare 2 there. I get all happy right here. I'm freaking out. I can't even walk through the door. And then, like, around the last, like, three seconds. I'm not even kidding. It's, like, right there. Yeah, I'm so happy. Oh, nope, nope, nope. No victory for you, Shadow. No victory for you. You get the victory, but you come in second. 